Welcome back to YouTube channel. This channel is a channel that reviews the latest luxury cars. This time I will review the McLaren 620R Sports Series. Before continuing, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. The base of the 570S is still sexy enough for McLaren to be developed into more variants, one of which is for consumers who like racing. As McLaren did through its newest product, the McLaren 620R. McLaren 620R is officially launched as the highest variant of the sports series for consumers who want racing performance on the road. GT4 class racing specifications are carried over to the 620R which is also in limited production by McLaren. This car is a road illegal version of the 570 SGT for race car with a series of specification adjustments. That way, the automatic 620R is in a higher segment than the 60LT that launched last year. The 3.8-liter turbo V8 engine in this car is the fiercest for the sports series, producing 612 horsepower and 620 Newton meters of torque greater than the GT4 because it is not subject to regulation. To accelerate from 0 to 100 km per hour, the 620R only takes to 0.9 seconds. With a top speed of 320 to km per hour, armed with a 7 at speed seamless shift gearbox. The advantages of the GT4 specifications are applied to the 620R such as the monocell to chassis made from single piece carbon fiber. The empty weight of this car is even only 1280 to kilograms. Furthermore, the specifications of the circuit carried also include adjustable aerodynamic elements, suspension, and racing performance braking systems. The 620R's rear wing is even the same as that of the 570 SGT4 to ensure optimal downforce, as are the splitters and front bumper. Each side of the wheel. The character of the suspension can be adjusted through 32 adjustment points, weighing even 6 kilograms lighter than the standard version. Steady handling is also supported by Pirelli P0 Trofeo R semi-slick tires, which are available in full slick options. The limited 620R is marked by 350 units being produced. To be able to have it, prepare money at least 250 pounds. Zero or equivalent to RP for 0.557 billion. The limited 620R is marked by 350 units being produced. To be able to have it, prepare money at least 250 pounds. Zero or equivalent to RP for 0.557 billion. Speed fans on the road will surely imagine how the McLaren 570 SGT4 can be sped up on the highway. It turns out that this dream is already in McLaren's mind to be realized for its fans with the McLaren 620 variant. Yup, the McLaren 620R has been homologated to be able to glide on the highway. And the owner can feel the acceleration and high speed of the 570 SGT for which has won several races. This is a response to consumer demand. We have homologated the package for the road to the 620R which is a limited edition. Based on the 620 PS Super Light Coupe, which is suitable for enthusiasts who want to experience the sensation of racing firsthand and its performance is comparable to use on the racetrack and on the road, Mike Fluid, Chief Executive Officer, McLaren Automotive. The sensation is driving a racing car on the highway because the engine used is a standard GT for racing engine, the 3,800cc meter 830AT type with dual turbo. Unlimited engine EQ and turbocharger so that it can deploy 610 horsepower and become the most powerful sports series. Torque also presents 619.6 Newton meters. Naturally, if the acceleration 0 to 96 km per hour can be achieved into 0.8 seconds and accelerated from 0 to 200 kpj can be redeemed in 8.1 seconds. Well, the driver can inscribe the speedometer needle at 321 km per hour. The ferocious power. 
McLaren claims to be needed thanks to the use of a deceleration device with a disc diameter of 390 mm at the front and 380 mm at the rear. Lightweight aluminum material is used in the brake calipers, gripping to asphalt surfaces. The 620R relies on the semi-slick Pirelli P0 Trofeo R. If you want better grip, when on the circuit you can use full slick tires. Well, that's the review about the latest McLaren 620R. Sports car. Hopefully it's useful and continue to support this channel by liking, comments, and subscribing. And see you in the next video.